Would you look at that, hotties? This is my first lookbook in literal years. And it's what I wear in a week. So lately, I have been so obsessed with monochrome and pastel colors. And for Monday, you know, typically we're all kind of sluggish and having shitty days. And so if I'm out and about wearing something cute, you can usually find me in a yoga set. Recently, I've been really obsessed with aloe yoga. They have so many adorable colors and recently pastel yellow has been a favorite for me. And for my bag, I went with a light pink little baby handbag, which is currently my favorite bag from Prada. And this has been one of my favorite handbags. When I first bought it, I honestly kind of regretted it because I hated the nylon. I was like, oh God, why did I spend so much money on this stupid bag? But actually it's so lightweight and so easy to throw on. And it's such a desaturated pink color. I feel like it goes super well with most of my outfits. So this has been my go-to bag lately. And I really, really love how casual it is. And for my shoes, I'm wearing the Triple S from Balenciaga. It's been a really nice staple in my wardrobe lately. These days, it's not Tuesday, let's say that I'm going out to get some lunch with some friends. This is another monochrome look featuring my favorite color, which is lilac. My dress is from Urban Outfitters, and this is a random dress that I picked up one day. I wasn't even thinking much about it, but this has become one of my favorite dresses of the season, and I've just been wearing it so much. It's so comfortable and easy to throw on, and because of the silhouette, it doesn't look sloppy, and it looks really put together. For my bag, I'm wearing my precious Jackie bag from Gucci. I never bought such a statement color before and I am so glad that I did. It's a really easy bag to throw on and it's also so comfortable and fits so much. For my hair, I went with something a little bit more spunky and cute. And for my necklace, I finally made the plunge and bought the famous slash infamous Vivian Westwood pearl choker. It just really elevates anything that I'm wearing, whether it's a t-shirt and a pair of jeans or a simple dress like this. For my stockings, I'm wearing some thigh-high sheer white stockings with some bow details, and I'm wearing my trusty Miu Miu Mary jeans to tie together the whole look. It's Wednesday, my dudes. This outfit is kind of cottage core and casual at the same time. I can definitely see myself stomping around Melrose, Hollywood, or LA for a shopping day and some lunch with my friends. For the first time in like 10 years, I have become so obsessed with wearing jeans. And it's because I found the perfect jeans of my life. And surprisingly, they were some random cheapo jeans that just happened to fit extremely well. I really played up with my accessories to give it a bit of a pastel rainbow look. I've been really into bandanas recently and I've been collecting so many of them and I really love this checkered bandana in combination with these butterfly hair clips. When your outfit is looking a little bit too casual, you can definitely make it so much cuter if you just accessorize the hell out of your hair. Because it's kind of more casual with the jeans, I wanted to dress it back up on the bottoms. So I'm wearing my Mimi platform shoes and I brought back my pink Prada handbag because I kind of wanted to go along with the desaturated pastel colors. I have a bit more of a fancy outfit. Let's say that I'm going somewhere where I definitely want to take photos. So this is one of my favorite dresses of the season. I love the silhouette of this so much and the exaggerated puff sleeves and the giant collar all make it a super interesting silhouette and it's definitely a very irreplaceable piece in my closet. The details on this dress definitely made the price point so worth it for me. The embroidery of the flowers are so delicate. I love rainbow but it can definitely become so overwhelming when you're working with too many colors in your outfit. So I love a pastel rainbow focusing on a lot of whites. Because I've been more into vintage silhouettes recently, I paired this outfit with a headscarf. This is something that I purchased when I was vintage shopping, and I paired the rest of this outfit with my trusty favorite Miu Miu crystal bag, and again, my Miu Miu platform shoes. I feel like what really helped me elevate my closet and pull together my style was a foolproof 
move go-to pair of shoes and a handbag. And for me, my go-to color is always white because I have a lot of pastels in my closet. So whenever I need to accessorize and dress up an outfit, but I don't know what to wear, I always go with this shoe and bag combo. most definitely having a lazy day at some point and I've been skateboarding with my friends and this is just a really super lazy casual skate outfit that I just plop on. Although it's super casual, oversized, slouchy, it still feels really like myself because it's monochrome and it's also my favorite color. This set is from Oi and I love their pieces. I wouldn't say that they're the most comfortable in terms of fabric but I'm obsessed with their colorways and also the fit. To pull together the rest of this monochrome outfit, I got these lilac vans, which are my first pair of skate shoes. Um, I actually do skate in these, so forgive me, they're a little bit beat up and kind of dirty, but you know, that's what skate shoes are for. Saturdays, I generally assume that at least one day out of the week, I'm doing something kind of fancy. I love to wear all white because it's so striking. I think it's a really bold color choice because it's hard to keep your whites pristine. This is a new blouse that I purchased from For Love and Lemons recently, and I kind of just wanted to invest in a nice blouse that I can throw on with any outfit, whether it's something more casual or more dressed up. And this bottom is also from For Love and Lemons, but it's so surprisingly comfortable that I always find myself slipping into this. Again, I paired this outfit with my iconic duo, my Miu Miu bag and shoes. This is why I think that it's so important for when you're discovering your style and trying to solidify it, that you have a go-to bag and shoe combo. For my hair, I went with my signature double bows and I finished off this outfit with some accessories, which are my pearl necklace, which again, dresses up any outfit that you have, and also my Miu Miu sunglasses. And that's it for this video. I'm sorry, I know I skipped out on Sunday, but actually, to be honest, when I was filming this video, I had no idea what the concept was, but then I kind kind of realized, oh, this is what I would wear in a week, but unfortunately I didn't film enough outfits for that day, so let's just say that this is approximately what I would wear in a week. I had so much fun filming this with my friends in their studio. It felt so good to make a lookbook again because it's been so long. So that's it for this week. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love and appreciate you all, and I will see you guys again next week.